Uh, hello everyone to anything a day again. Um, today we're going to solve a problem on real analysis by Folland. And the question number is 1.4.17. Okay, I'm just going to go straight into the question. Um, so we have to show that firstly that mu star e intersection to union of aj's. And this is mu star union of E intersection AJ. And this is a property that holds due to the De Morgan's law, I think. Well, I'm not exactly sure, but it doesn't really matter. So then, then all we need to do is, the because of the fact that this part is disjoint due to the property of AJ's, if we can show that this is measurable, well, in, to be more specific in the book, it's mu star measurable. Then we can show that this holds, that is the summation automatically holds. So we'll, we'll be able to show this. So we need to, we just need to show that e, e intersection aj is measurable. Sorry for a bit of a bad notation. Um, so um, what we do is that for some t, for some set, subset t, we need to show that mu t is mu t intersection this and plus oh, mu star mu star t intersection e intersection with a j complement. But we can easily see that this holds because we already know that e is measurable. And if you look at this part, they both belong to the the power set so basically this is just also a subset of x so because of the fact that e is measurable we can see that this will also hold for all e intersection aj aj's because that's the property of the measurable set e so due to this fact um the property holds so this means that e intersection aj is in fact measurable So using this fact, we can easily see that the above, in above equality, which we wanted it to hold, actually does hold. So using this, we were able to solve the question. And that's and for today. That's the end for today. And thank you all for coming.